Good day, babies! Welcome back to Baby Math Notes. You may try to learn mathematics with the aid of this channel. But don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you will be updated for our new notes. Today, let us talk about quadratic functions using table of values. So sa video na ito, malalaman natin kung ang given table of values ay quadratic function or not. So let us have example number 1. Let us consider y is equal to x squared plus 2x plus 1. Dito sa given equation natin, makikita natin kung ano yung highest degree niya. It is in a second degree. Now, if we construct table of values of the given function, we will have the following values. Then, let us plot the points on the Cartesian plane. So, when x is equal to negative 3, y is equal to 4. And when x is equal to negative 2, y is equal to 1. When x is equal to negative 1, y is equal to 0. And when x is equal to 0, y is equal to 1. Then when x is equal to 1, y is equal to 4. Now, let us connect the points. Ang nakuha nating graph ay parabola. And we all know that the graph of quadratic function is a parabola. Now, what if table of values lang yung given? And then, you are going to tell whether the given table of values is quadratic function or not. What are we going to do? So first, get the differences in x. Paano ba natin yung kukunin? So we are going to subtract from right to left. So let us start with 1 minus 0 is 1. 0 minus negative 1 is 1. Negative 1 minus negative 2 is 1 also. And negative 2 minus negative 3 is 1. So as you can see, nakuha natin yung differences in x. Nakuha na natin yung equal. Equal sila. So now, let us proceed to the values of y. We are going to subtract and get the differences in y. So let us start with 4 minus 1 is 3. 1 minus 0 is 1. 0 minus 1 is negative 1. 1 minus 4 is negative 3. So kung mapapansin natin, hindi pa sila equal. So pwede pa natin kunin yung differences nila. So, ang tawag dito sa una nating kinuha ay first differences in y since kukunin pa natin yung pangalawang differences nila. So, let us start. 3 minus 1 is 2. 1 minus negative 1 is 2. Negative 1 minus negative 3 is 2. And we got equal answers, right? So, ito yung pangalawang differences ng y natin. So, ibig sabihin, at sa value ng independent variable natin, nakuha agad natin yung equal differences nila. And then, sa values ng y or ng dependent variable natin, nakadalwa tayong subtract. So, bago sila nag-equal. Therefore, we can say that the table of values of equation y is equal to x squared plus 2x plus 1 is an example of quadratic function because it has equal differences in the independent variable x produce equal second differences in the dependent variable y. Now, let us have example number 2. Let us consider y is equal to 2x plus 2. So, kung mapapansin natin, ano ba yung degree niya? It is in the first degree. And if we construct table of values of the given function, 
we have the following values. Now, let us plot the points on the Cartesian plane. If x is equal to negative 2, y is equal to negative 2. If x is equal to negative 1, y is equal to 0. If x is equal to 0, y is equal to 2. And if x is equal to 1, y is equal to 4. And if x is equal to 2, y is equal to 6. Now, let us connect the points. So as we can see, we have a straight line, right? And we all know that the graph of a linear function is a straight line. But what if the only given is the table of values? Hindi given yung equation natin, wala rin graph. So paano ba natin malalaman kung itong given table of values na ito ay quadratic function or not? Ano ba ang kaibahan nito dun sa una nating example kanina? Since ang una nating example ay nasa second degree kanina. And yung graph na nakuha natin doon is a parabola. So now, we are going to get the differences in x. Pareho lang yun ang process katulad kanina sa example number 1. So we are going to subtract from right to left. Let us start with 2 minus 1 is... 1. 1 minus 0 is 1. 0 minus negative 1 is 1. And negative 1 minus negative 2 is 1 also. Makikita nyo, ayan siya, equal na yung nakuha natin na differences ng x. Equal siya. So now, let us proceed to the values of the dependent variable y. So let us start with 6 minus 4 is equal to 2, 4 minus 2 is equal to 2, 2 minus 0 is equal to 2, 0 minus negative 2 is 2. So as you can see, nakuha natin yung first differences sa y, pero ang sagot nila equal agad. Yung kanina sa example 1 natin, nakadalawa tayong subtract bago siya nag-equal. So therefore, we can say that the table of values of equation y is equal to 2x plus 2 is an example of linear function because it has equal differences in the independent variable x produce equal first differences in the dependent variable y. Now, let us have a practice task. Given the table of values below, which of the following represents a quadratic function? A B So, ang pamilya natin, A or B, alin kaya dyan? So, given a table of values, ang quadratic function. Take note, without graphing. So, i-apply na natin yung natutunan natin kanina. Kukunin natin yung differences sa variable x. And then, kukunin din natin yung differences ng values ng y. So, let us start. Huwag natin kalimutan na ang pagkuha ng differences is from right to left. So, 1 minus 0 is 1. 0 minus negative 1 is 1. Negative 1 minus negative 2 is 1. So, as you can see, equal yung differences ng values ng x natin. So, proceed na tayo sa y. 5 minus 2 is 3. 2 minus negative 1 is 3. Negative 1 minus negative 4 is 3 also. So as you can see, nag-equal na siya agad. Unang kuha pa lang natin ang differences. So ibig sabihin, itong given na table of values natin sa letter A ay linear function. Tingnan natin yung letter B. So let us get the differences of the values of x. So, let us start with 4 minus 3 is 1. 3 minus 2 is 
1, 2 minus 1 is 1, and 1 minus 0 is 1 also. So, we got equal differences in x. Now, so y values naman. Negative 5 minus negative 8 is 3. Negative 8 minus negative 9 is 1. Negative 9 minus negative 8 is negative 1. Then negative 8 minus negative 5 is negative 3. Oops! Hindi pa natin nakuha yung equal differences nila. So, itry pa natin. Kunin natin sa pangalawang pagkakataon. So, let us get the second differences of y values. So, let us start with 3 minus 1 is 2. 1 minus negative 1 is 2. And negative 1 minus negative 3 is 2 also. Wow! So, ibig sabihin, itong given table of values natin ay quadratic function. Therefore, the given table of values in letter B represents a quadratic function. Now, let's try this. The following table of values below represents quadratic function, except 1. So, the answer is letter D. Congratulations! Great job, babies! Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you will be updated for our new notes. See you on our next Baby Month Notes.